We've updated the Royal College guidelines on the timely delivery of radical radiotherapy as it's been approximately 10 years since the last edition was published. And although unplanned radiotherapy treatment gaps occur far less frequently than they used to, this still remains a clinically important issue which needs to be addressed appropriately. So we know that patients who have significant treatment prolongation and uh, unplanned treatment gaps are often associated with worse clinical outcomes and worse local control rates. And so these guidelines seek to address uh, the priority which different patients should be given based on their underlying tumour and also uh, devise a series of ways in which this can be addressed appropriately. We were fortunate to be updating a well-written set of guidelines which has stood the test of time over the last 10 years. We consulted with radiotherapy managers and experts from around the country and also with experts from the IPEM and colleagues abroad also. We have aimed to come up with a set of pragmatic guidelines which can be used by radiotherapy services and we've updated sections on breast, anal and lung cancer in light of the available clinical evidence which is limited.